Since bears have emerged from their dens, I've been getting calls from Penticton, from Caledon, from Twin Lakes, and from Summerland. Bears came out of their dens about a month ago, hungry, and in the case of this young bear recently spotted in Summerland, not shy about wandering into residential neighborhoods. I was running through yards and climbing trees and knocking over some garbage cans, being a, being a brat. He wasn't really shy, that's for sure. He was uh, poking around a bit. I took a couple pictures. I said, you know, I didn't have time to kind of sit there and look too long, but he was a young guy. I, don't know, I think he's only probably a year old. Each and every day, the need for calories increases. So they're upwards of five to 6,000 calories a day, every day, to feed those cubs or to put the fat back on that they've lost. There are precautions residents can take to keep bears away from your garbage. One, don't put it out before the morning of pickup. Two, consider how it is going to sit at the curbside and what it's gonna smell like. So I always advocate the use of bleach and water. You can easily spritz that can. Bears have a nose that's five times more sensitive than a bloodhound, so bleach is going to overpower their nose. And also, if you use the bleach and water, it also tends to keep these little critters away. While bears normally stay within interface areas and utilizing the forest as a cover, they are getting bolder as they get hungrier. We've had bears in downtown Penticton, we've had them in downtown Summerland, so everyone needs to abide by those simple rules of keeping garbage maintained safely and securely and only putting it out on the morning of pickup. Because it isn't just the bears we have to be worried about, it's coyotes, it's your neighbor's dog, it's the rats and the raccoons. Along with keeping your garbage secure, Residents are reminded to manage fruit trees properly, feed your pets inside, keep your barbecue clean, and remember, bird feeders often become bear feeders. For Castanet News, I'm Dale Corey in Penticton.